are heartbroken, you're sad, you feel empty. Is it really them that you're missing? I'm Laurel House. I'm a celebrity dating empowerment and breakup expert. You may recognize me from E's Famously Single or MTV. And this is a question that I get a lot from my private dating clients. And I ask them to think about, was it them that you loved? Is it them who you miss? Or is it you? Is it who you were with them? Is it what they brought out of you? Because the good news is, that's still in you. That happy, excited, driven, motivated, calm, loving, nurturing, spontaneous, adventurous, whatever it was, you, it's still there. Yeah, they brought it out. Thank you for bringing that out of me. Thank you for reminding me that that's who I am. And now I can bring that to life on my own and bring that to the table to maybe another relationship. Think about what characteristics, attitude, personalities come out of you with various different people. You're probably different with every single person in your life, with different relationships, with a boyfriend or girlfriend, with your parents, with your friends, with your siblings, with your children, with your clients, with your bosses, with your whoever. You are different. They are bringing out a different side of who you are. You might really love them. Do you love them or do you love you with them? Do you love who you are because of them? Do you love what they bring out of you and illuminate in you? I mean, think about Think about your children. I know for me, I have an almost three-year-old son, and I'm a different person with him. I speak in different voices. I'm softer. I'm more nurturing. I'm a lot of different things that I'm not with other people. I love who I am as a mom, and I'm going to be different than I am when I'm dating or with my friends. Of course, you love that person, too. It's not just that you love who you are because of them or with them. I love my child. I love my husband. I love my parents. I love my friends. I love them and who they are as people, who they are as individuals. The I honor where they've been, how far they've come, what they've gone through, who they are. But it's not just about them. It's about you. And it's essential that you acknowledge both. So if you're sitting here missing them, I want you to think about it if it's really them you miss, or if it's you, if it's what they brought to life. And remember that you can be that again all the time if you choose to. It might be a little bit more difficult because they did bring it out of you and something about their personality that that made that come to life. So find other avenues, find other people, find other things, find other outlets that allow you to be you again. And yes, there still will be some space without them. There are aspects of your relationship, the partnership, the togetherness, the not being alone that you you sincerely do miss and it's just about them not you and and that you can find again you will find again but you need to heal you first you need to fill that hole and don't let that hole just sit there gaping because they're gone allow yourself to fill you with you be full of yourself and all of the greatness that you discovered because of them all the greatness that came out of you because of them. And once you're the fuller, best you, then get out there and meet someone new and see what amazing sides they're going to bring out of you too. Thank you so much for watching. Please like this video if you liked it and subscribe to my channel. You can work with me. I can help you get through this breakup because I know it's hard. I've been there and I can help. Go to my website, laurelhouse.com, or just email me directly, laurel at laurelhouse.com. You can also follow me on Instagram at laurelhouse and Facebook and Twitter at Dating Laurel.
I hope to see you again soon.